Welcome you, to the village of Sardinia. It's a lovely place. You, it's a lovely place. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> what? We are the world. We are the children. And I won't go any further because I could fall into the water. Welcome to Sardinia. All Welcome. right. Eddie Guerrero forever. And yeah, we're done. Santiago. Santiago and Eddie. and Eddie. And Eddie. Guys are driving down a uh, dirt road again. We're heading towards uh, Cerro Sands and Copper, what? Copperback Beach Resort, that's called? Cerro's Beach Resort. Cerro's Beach Resort and Cerro Sands. We're heading there. I don't know if we'll make it, but it says the road going there. It says outside of Copperbank Village. Sartane has got talent. Talent, yeah. Yes, I. <laughs> Guys, we are here at Cerro Sands at Blackbeard's. I think it's a restaurant bar. Never been here before. Let's go check it out. It seems to be closed. The door going into that building behind me there is closed. We're gonna walk around the front. Oh no, it's all fenced up. It's all fenced up? Yeah, I guess it's closed. Yeah. The Blackbeard's Blackbeard restaurant is that there? A restaurant the Blackbeard is I yeah? No seven. My restaurant here? Yeah? Si hay? Pero está cerrado o abierto? Oh, cerrado. Guys, it's closed. Alright. Uh, keep on rolling. Keep on rolling, rolling, rolling. Gotta keep on rolling. I guess no business. Sunday. Guys, we're here at Blackbirds. It's closed today. But it's very pretty. Very pretty. This is the restaurant bar area. People hanging out. This is the restaurant bar. Look, flags from all over the world. Looks nice. Muy bonito aquí. Pero no hay refresco, no hay cerveza, nada. Falta. Falta. Si, eso falta, si. But this is pretty. Too bad it's closed down today. Cap collection. Yeah, this is awesome, guys. Too bad it's closed today. We snuck through the back because um, we saw a bunch of Mennonites coming in. So we said, well, let's follow them and see where it leads us. Yeah. It's a cool place to chill out. Very cool place to chill out. Mark Leonard, he did a great job here. Wow, a lot of nice houses here. Well, what a shame. Everything is closed today. There's a bunch of Mennonites around. I think they sneak in to go swimming. I asked them, are you staying in a the hotel? They said, yeah, but I don't even know if there are hotel rooms here. So I think they just come in here to go swimming. Who knows what the deal is? It would have been great check it out check out the bar I've heard about a lot about it I've heard a lot about it I've heard a lot about it but not gonna happen so let's head somewhere else ready to keep on rolling I need to use the bathroom I have I, to go pee -pee. I, 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 I. I'm being attacked by friendly dogs guys we went to um, Sarah Sands and the Blackbeard that was a bust they were closed. Hello. Hi. Are you guys open? No. Not open either. 
We went to Sarah Sands, also closed, everybody yeah. closed. We're getting ready, we're starting our vacation tomorrow. So. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. That was a long drive getting here. <laughs> They're closed also. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> We took so long to get here. Yeah. Yeah, like a half an hour drive off the main road. Yeah. It's far. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't have that much food because we're, we used it all down. We're going yeah. on vacation, oh, so. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's why. Yeah. That's why you can. Yeah. All uh, right. And not many people come around here. No, we? not this time of year. Oh. You know, this is all the Belizean holidays. It's oh. the month of September. Oh, yeah. Uh, all the Belizeans come back to party with their families, but. Yeah. Yeah. No, I, I was figuring we'd be, I was figuring we packed can, out can here we with locals. Use your bathroom to go yeah, pee -pee? yeah, yeah. Thank yeah. you. Go ahead. Go girls, go girls. <laughs> they have to go pee pee, so. <laughs> yeah, we went by Mark Leonard's. We yeah, they're there too. And too. Yeah. They're closed too, but yeah. they're, they're like a whole bunch of men and I swimming there hanging out in his bar that's closed. <laughs> I think I think they snuck in. I think they snuck no, in. No, they there. just use that. I don't think he, he doesn't mind too much. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we're just getting ready. Our, our friend's coming over because they're going to watch our dogs for us. So we're going over like what yeah. to do. <laughs> yeah, I know how that goes. Thank you. <laughs> I think I've seen you. Yeah, you have? Yeah. Yeah, on YouTube. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I said we got to come here. Maybe, maybe we could take a little look around. You yeah, know, if you want. Yeah, put it on YouTube fine. for yeah, what it yeah. looks like. Yeah, that would be fine. All right, thanks. Guys, they are closed because they're getting ready to go on vacation. But they gave me permission to walk around and show you show you this place here, Cerro Sands. They have cabanas that they rent out, like hotels, see? But they say it's slow at this time of the year. So that's why they go on vacation. This is the grounds. I think that's the restaurant in there. Looks like that would be the restaurant and bar. Too bad it's closed because the drive in here was I don't know, half an hour off the paved road. It was it was a long haul, long, bumpy, bad road. Ah, oh, here's some sea breeze blowing again. When you're off wind, it's really hot. But the amazing thing here is you can see the lights of Corozal town from the beach here. You won't be able to see it with this camera. But Corozal town is right back there. Right there. I'm going to try to take a picture with my phone and zoom in. Let's see how it works out. I'll stick it in here. Hopefully the picture turns out that I installed right here that you're watching right now. I zoomed in as good as I could, tried not to shake. If you don't see it, it's because it didn't work. Here at Cerros Beach Resort on the Cerros Peninsula here in Corozal District, Belize. Well, we went to Cerros Sands. It was closed. We went now to Cerros Beach Resort. It is also closed. So there's one more resort called Orchid Bay Resort. I'm not going to drive. These roads are just too bad. And then we get there and they'll probably be closed also. So we're calling that off. We're going to go now. We're going to drive towards Sartaneja. Once you get back to the paved road, they say it's about 25 minutes on the paved road. So yeah, that sounds like a deal. And they have a bridge over the river too. So that's what we're gonna do. We're not gonna try the Orchid Bay because I don't want to drive on more bad roads like this just to find a place that's closed. So let's go to Sartaneja.
this goes good. It's about a foot and a half deep. But we are here, Sardinia. Uh, guys, so we're looking for some place we can, I don't know, get a snack or buy a Coke or something. Take a look, we're gonna meet the ocean now. Here in Sardineja, wow. Look, when you die, you spend front. eternity right on beachfront. This is pretty. So I guess this is downtown Sartaneja here. This is the dock where the Thunderbolt and the Belize Water Express. That's where they, when they come to pick you up or drop you off in Sartaneja. This station is closed. <laughs> That's the dock where they stop and let you off or pick you up. Oh, free Wi Fi here. Ah, this part there. Looks like this is a little restaurant bar. Not this after this one. Yeah. Crabby's hut. Oh yeah, here it is. It's open. Is it open? Yeah, Alright, so we're gonna go back. We'll take a little drive. Take a little drive here in Sartane and we're gonna stop at Crabby's hut and get something, maybe a ceviche. Water's nice Coke out here. Zero. Very pretty. This is Sartaneja village in the more northernmost tip of Corza. This one's open too. Oh, it's open. Krabby's looks better. Yeah. It's nice guys, they got a drive all along the waterfront here. Nice beach drive. The road is pretty good. Paved gravel. Can't complain. Chartanea is also a big fishing village. A lot of expats live here. And getting into tourism a little bit either. See these here are fishing boats. I take them out to work on them, clean them up, get them ready for the next season. Have you guys ever been to Sardinia? Let me know. Or do you live in Sardinia currently and watching this video? Let me know. That's a big boat there.
This is the end of Sardineja. Almost looks like at least the end of the paved road. Okay, uh, I'm not. I'm not going there. I'm gonna turn around no, here. You're not passing that. No. I am turning around here. Definitely not getting through that. Let me turn the camera off because I gotta turn around. There's a deep hole there. Not taking a chance. Oh, what a long drive to get to Sartaneja. We're gonna go over to here to Krabby's right now. I hope they have ceviche. I need a ceviche and a Coke Zero. I don't want no beer. We drank a lot of beer yesterday. But this is Sartaneja, guys. Look at it, it's beautiful. Over there, I won't be able to film because there's like a lot of music and loud. But look at this dock here. This is the water taxi dock. Here's a map of Sartaneja. You can pause here so you can check it out good. Hi, look at this. Florencia Marine Street. That's our neighbor. Used to be the Deputy Prime Minister of Belize. Lived almost next door to us in Corzal Town. Sartaneja. Uh, here's another sign with lots of information about Belize. You can pause and read it here. But let's go look for something to snack on. Come hungry. I'm thirsty. And I'm tired. I'm tired. Bumpy roads. I don't like bumpy roads. But the cyber combi is doing a great job, really good. Okay guys, we have running water in this van. Carlita's washing her hands. See here? You can run it in the sink or this goes longer, you can use that for showering outside. Cybercombi, that's why it's called Cybercombi, because it does everything even better than a cyber truck at the Sartaneja police station. Let's go see what's jumping at Krabby's. I hope they have ceviche. I need a ceviche really bad. <laughs> Guys, Krabby's was a bust. Because um, we wanted something like seafood or something, ceviche or something like that, and all they have is nachos. So I, I don't want nachos. We're on the beach. We're on the beach. We want some seafood, shrimp, or fish, or something like that. So, vamonos again. How you rasty? <laughs> Let's go. Oh, sorry. Let's go see what else you find. Oh, Krabby's was a bus. I'm going to try this here, Isadora. Is it just a bar or is it a restaurant and a bar? Let's see, Isadora. Yes, restaurant and bar. So, let's go try it out. I hope they have a ceviche. I'm really hungry for a ceviche. Hey, hey. Isadora. Fresh and bar. Put me this. Put me this. It's good. This, I do this music. See? These guys are going to sing? Just tell me when you're ready. All right. Ready? Ready. Now? Yeah. Welcome to this village of Sartanica. It's a lovely place. It's a lovely place. Welcome to this village of Sartanica. You'll find some nice friends, you'll find a friend. When you come to the village of Sartanega, 
It's the lovely place. It's the lovely place. Any girl, Sartania. <laughs> very good, right. very good, yeah. Welcome to Sartania, any girl. The kind time. When the world or then call a windy world. My sky together as one. There's a people lying. And it's time to lend my hand. And the light. Let's start this way because the light. Greatest give of God. We can go on. Pretending the And not someone. So we always soon make a change. There's a people lying. And it's time to lend my hand and the life. The greatest gift of God. We are the world. We are the children. We are the ones who make a better day. So let's all give it. There's the chance of making. We saving our life and the children. In the love is all we need. We are the world. We are the children. We are the ones who make a better day. Let's get it. There's people lying. And it's time to lend my hand on the life. The greatest gift of God. We can go on. Pretending they fight then. And not so one. So we will soon make a change. It's a change of making. We're saving our life and the children. You know, love is all we need. We are the world. We are the children. We are the ones who make a big change. Let's give it. God. Welcome to Saturnia. All right. Eddie Guerrero forever and ever. Santiago. Santiago and Eddie. And Eddie. Eddie. Have a nice day to care. Sartane has got talent. Talent. Yeah. Yes, yes I. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Take care, man. Yeah, take care. God bless Thank you. you. Have a nice evening and a nice day. All right. Welcome you. to the village of Sartane. It's a lovely place. It's a lovely place. <laughs> Goodbye. All right. Take care, care man. Bye. Yeah. Tonight I will, I will sing karaoke over there. Yeah, all right. You see me, my talent. More okay. Better. There you have it, guys. Welcome to Sartaneja. Eddie Guerrero and his friend. I forgot his friend's name. So, let's go, guys. We're going to go here to Isadora Restaurant Bar. That was funny. And I hope they got some beach. I want some beach, man. Yeah, man. It sounds hopping up here. There's gonna be a lot of music in that, so I won't be able to do really anything up here. But I'll let you know how it goes. Well, guys, this is a cool place. Look at this. Music is off right now. It's busy, it's busy. Bathrooms, pool bar, big TV, nice looking bar. And here is the crowd hanging out. Oh yeah. Huh? Your 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 Volkswagen bus. I oh love, yeah. I love it. Yeah, I know. They are so much fun. Those things. Air cooled motor. And this one actually has a radiator. Oh, you got a radiator. Yeah, I got a radiator. Oh, yeah, okay. it's a 1999. Oh. Yeah. But the motor's in the back. Motor's in the back. Yeah. And but radiator it's, but in it's the front. water cooled. But water cooled. Yeah. I did not know they ever made those. Yeah. Well, yeah. they didn't. They, they were never available in the U.S. I know. Yeah. They, yeah. they actually told me I found out later air cooled is actually better because it's a more simple engine. It is very yeah. simple. But you then, don't have a water pump. You don't. Have a, yeah. Yeah. But I found out too late. I already bought this one. I bought. I got the water cooled because they said oh, it was a lot more powerful than that. So I figured, okay, I get the water cooled. And then they mm. told me no, you should get air cooled. But too late now. A lot quieter the water cooled. Yeah, 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 they are. Yeah, water, air cooled were noisy. Yeah, they had that distinctive sound. Yeah, they yeah. did. Yeah, you knew it was a Volkswagen coming yeah. down the road. <laughs> yeah, I used to have. We used to have a Beetle before. Oh yeah. And yeah, you could hear that from a mile away. My buddy had a Beetle. Yeah, oh, yeah. you know the sound. You know that sound. You know that. Yeah, yeah, yeah they were very distinctive. Yeah. But yeah, I love the look of those 
Yeah. That thing looks in really good shape. Oh, yeah, it's very well taken care of. Yeah, this very the top well. lifts up. No, no top lifts no, up on no, that. Oh, no, okay. Yeah, I would have liked the top, have, but that doesn't have. They have no ceviches. They have no ceviches. No ceviches here. No. Oh, where do you get ceviche on here? But he can tell you where to go to get yeah. it. Yeah. All right. Well, it's good talking to you. Yeah. Same here. What's your name? Gladwin. I'm Doug. Doug. Yeah. And this is like the expat bar I noticed. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's owned by an expat. Oh, it is. Oh, yeah, yeah, all right. Yeah. yeah, we need ceviche. I'm so hungry for a Belizean ceviche. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I think there's only about one place in town where you can get it. Uh huh. This is the only road there. Down, down the street. This street here? Yeah, it's called um, Sabor Arcoiris. Yeah. At the, um, the corner of the main one. Yeah. Yeah, Sabor Arcoiris. You can all right. check it out there. It all has right. like a. A rainbow painting with some paletas and a Ice cream and Alright, yeah, we're gonna go check it out. To go. Yeah, you can't come to a fishing village and eat hamburgers. Yeah. <laughs> yeah something's wrong yeah, about that. No, no. Something is wrong about that. I no. love a good hamburger, but fishing village, I need some seafood. Yeah, we, we built a house here while we came down about two years ago. We built a house and yeah. we hired a bunch of fishermen in the off season. Yeah. And they keep bringing me seafood now. I know, yeah. They just come give it to me lobster, uh -huh. fish. Yeah. Uh, Good stuff, good, good stuff. stuff yeah. yeah. How long have you been living here? Almost two years. Almost two years, yeah. yeah. Now the road is pr almost pretty good. Almost, almost, almost pretty good, yeah. Yeah. I better. mean, coming here, it was like, wow, this is great. And then we hit the bad beast, but they're going to get that paved in it. So, which way anywhere. did you come from? From Corza. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah. This is yeah. And the bridge is the bridge is going in. It's it's paved. So it's only got we well, get the bridge finished in three miles of pavement. It'll be good. To yeah, go. it'll be really. And they're gonna pave it all the way through town too. Yeah, that'd be great. That would be great. They Pro just did Front Street here. Yeah, I noticed that. Yeah, yeah. property values will go up. Property values. It'll be, easier, up it'll be easier to get in and out. It's gonna go from fishing village to resort town. Yeah, <laughs> that, that's very possible. Yeah, very, because very we're possible. just on the verge now of becoming. Going from village to town. Uh huh. Yeah. More yeah. population will be a town. All right. All right. Well, I'm gonna run because they're hungry. I'm starving myself. Okay. Okay. See you around. Good, Good to meet you. Yeah. No ceviche either. So we're gonna keep on moving. We're gonna keep on moving. Okay, we want some ceviche. This is a fishing village, so we want ceviche, guys. I like a good burger, like they have here. And the burger is probably excellent because they say an expat owns this place, so you know he'll know how to make he'll know how to make good burgers. But um, I do need some ceviche. So let's go and try one more place. If not, well, I'm gonna give up. Have to go, have to go to a city to eat a beach or something. It'd be a shame. So see you in a bit. See what happens. But this is a hopping bar. It looks great. It looks great up there. Well, we went to another place where they said they might have ceviche. We went there. And they said, yeah, we have ceviche, but it'd be 25 to 30 minute wait while we prepare the ceviche. So we just called it off. <laughs> we called it off. It's, I don't know. Something's not working good. It was right down the road there, place where the rain wanted. So we're gonna buy a Coke Zero. We're gonna go walk out onto the main dock, show you guys what it looks like. And then drive back to Corzo Town. Here in Sarteneja Fishing village We can't get seafood I don't know what's wrong Only nachos and hamburgers Ay 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 Guys guess what We are back to Isadora We're gonna have a hamburger We're back We're back it didn't work out with the ceviche, so we're back. We're gonna have burgers. Hey, it can cost you. Yeah, it's good. <laughs> hey, hey, you can do whatever you want. Yeah, no YouTube and us. <laughs> <laughs> Don't lose your vibe here. Get a lot of it. Yeah. 
Yeah, so we're gonna have burgers up there. It's owned by a Canadian, so probably make really good burgers. Now we're hungry, you know, it's it's a long drive back to Corzell Town. And we're starving. So burgers, hopefully they got fries. And that'll be Sartaneja. Here at Isadora restaurant and bar. Here in Sartaneja, look how look how people cruise around here. Our burgers have arrived. Hey guys, we are on the ferry and we are heading across the river. It's at night, it's pitch dark. Look at that. The bridge is back there. There's four cars on the ferry. And then um, they're cranking it by hand. They have no lights, no lights whatsoever on the ferry. There are more cars over there waiting waiting to for the ferry to come back i put on my i put on my headlights so that you could see a little something but it's dark here it is dark let me get back where the headlights are pitch dark and that's how these guys are operating in the darkness of the night cranking this thing Four cars here, all of us going across the river. Check it out. I don't know if you'll be able to see anything because of the darkness. And I won't go any further because I could fall into the water. See these cars over there on that side? Waiting to get on. This is how it's done until the bridge, the new bridge, over there, right over there. Yeah. Something to call him. What? I gotta go see. I think they gotta move the car. So, guys, I had to reverse the van because they need to balance the bridge. So, because we're going that way. We have to reverse so that the front end raises up so that it can get onto the land. And then once we touch land, then we all start heading to the front and then it goes down like that, the ramp. And that'll help us get off. Look at this. Running the ferry in the pitch of the night. Over there, they're partying over there. There's some cars over there, they're blasting the music. Full blast. And they're having a party. Here the guys are cranking my hand. <laughs> Look at that. No lights. No lights. Gotta keep on going because the ferry has to go. Traffic has to keep slowing. Wow. Well, that's the video, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. If you look really good where the light is there, that's where the bridge is gonna be. But for now, it's still the ferry. They say it should be done. They say it should be done by the end of the year. So let's see. I'll come back one day with another video and update you on the world's most dangerous ferry. But it's doing good. It's lisping a little bit to one side, but it's not as bad as it was the very first time I did film this place. So, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.